There's a floor-standing green non-inverter air conditioner that several mechanics tried to repair, but they couldn't fix it because of the tools they were using. Even if they had the experience, they weren't using the tools properly. And the issue is that its fuse was burned out very badly. Someone replaced the fuse, but there is still a problem after replacing it. For the high pressure, there is a switch available, but the installer is not installing it, which is causing the problem. So, let's take a closer look at what mistakes the installer is making and how we can fix this issue so that the E1 error on the display goes away. After inspecting everything, I didn't see any damage. Then, I followed the pipe toward the inside, and at this point, I noticed a hole where the rats had chewed through all the wires. The fuse blew due to these wires short-circuiting with each other. So I found the complete issue here and removed the damaged wires. Since the wire was quite long, we pulled it inside, completely cut it, and connected it to the indoor unit. Now it's testing time, so I'll turn it on and check if the unit is functioning correctly. Previously, the E1 error would appear within seconds, but now it's showing 32 degrees Celsius. If we look at the fan motor, the blower motor has started running perfectly. 